Hey dolls, it's your girl Vanity B back again and I'm back with another video. So today I wanted to do something a little different. Just uh, talk to you guys a little about my skincare and beauty for the spring. You know, it's that time where you start showing a little more skin and you just need to be ready. So I was like, I've been buying a bunch of stuff and I was like, well, why not show them like the things I got? Okay, I'm going to start off with lip care. Um, so one of the things I go into Bath and Body Works for is their um C.O. Bigelow Apothecaries uh, lip balms and or lip glosses I guess they are lip shines that's what they're called I freaking love these so first at first I knew only about kind of this one and the like pinks and the other colors and they're great they have like a touch of menthol in them so they always um smell like you're chewing a piece of gum and they're shiny they're intensively shiny so i love them and i feel like they're the only things that technically keep my lips super duper moisturized um my skin's on the drier side so that might have something to do with it but i love this stuff and then i found out that they had the one that has more menthol in it uh, the Times 2 Mentha Supreme, twice the moisture, twice the breath fresheners. Now, y'all know breath freshening does not come from lip gloss, it comes from brushing your teeth and oral hygiene. But anyways, I freaking love this stuff nonetheless. And so the last time I went in there, I happened to find this My Favorite Night Balm. And I didn't know that they had a uh, sleep lip balm but it says that it provides eight hour overnight recovery and so i just got this like less than a week ago so i'm gonna be trying all these things i've only used it a couple times but so far so good i'll get back to y'all on the review on that but speaking of lip care let's move on to the sugar advanced therapy by fresh i got this obviously from uh, sephora and this is like their little sample i can't remember how or why I got this but uh I use this during um like makeup application but also like every week I twice a week try to do a body care so like a spa day and so when I've um you know exfoliated my lips with lip scrub I immediately go in afterwards with this uh kind of like a, it's like a chapstick if you will um, just a, a lip treatment so I use that and then of course like I said before during makeup application I put it on just when I don't want to put on like something really really glossy on my lips to maintain the moisture until I put on my like lipstick or lip liner so speaking of lips and lip liner <clears throat> first of all shout out to Kyra Amonique because I'm like obsessed I love her I watch all her stuff like religiously she is so freaking cute hey Kyra um, but she was kind of going through her spring um, Sephora <clears throat> recommendations and she mentioned this Makeup Forever Artist Color Pencil in the color Limitless Brown and like I'm just going to put it on my hand but first oh I just broke it <laughs> but I was going to say that until I just broke it just now it has this like very soft pencil tip consistency that I've never seen of any um, pencil before usually they're hard like if you push down they kind of crack and break away this one doesn't it's very very soft and kind of pillowy and I love that um it comes off as this chestnut brown color but it if you rub it in it blends away very nicely and it can almost be an even softer brown um and I'll try to insert like a video of me putting it on but I guess that's why they call it limit limitless brown because it can be as like intense or like chola-y as you want it to be or it could be like real just soft and and just like barely there so she paired it with this um Dior 220 I think yeah 220 beige couture lippy and so i was like okay let me get it baby let me try let me see what she's talking about and it's like this very pinky nude it is lovely and let me swatch it for y'all too so this is again it's a creamy matte lipstick um it is very um Oh, y'all can't see it. Can y'all see it? I don't even know if you can see that because of the lighting. But it is a very um, soft pink. And it's really light. But when you pair it with the lip 
uh, liner it is bomb and it's also buildable so you can like make it as bright as you want or you can kind of rub it out and make it very very nude I'm here for it I've already tried it on I love the look combination so thank you Kyra boo <laughs> thank you all right so another thing I got um you know I got my all my little free my little points so every once in a while I see if they have anything of value for me to get because I don't want to spend my points unless I find something really good but this grande lash md so okay funny story about this I have been hunting this product down for a minute it was like sold out on their website and it was sold out in um sephora every time i would go and i was getting so upset like at one point i was literally probably like a couple years ago literally obsessively looking for this product couldn't find it anywhere i basically ended up forgetting about it and just stopped caring and then the other day i saw this but it's basically a lash enhancing serum um that you put on your lash line every day and it's supposed it's supposed to grow your lashes let me see um 94% of people saw healthier looking lashes, 91% saw longer looking lashes, and it's based on a 12 week consumer, consumer study with um, 30 subjects. So of course results will vary, um, and you can wear it with lash extensions or contacts is what it says. And this is a four week supply and it's just a clear serum you put on almost like, um, like eyeliner, so you just put it at the lash line. And it's Grand Grande Lash MD. And again, I just got all this stuff. So we're probably like on day two or three of me actually using it. So I can't speak to the results yet, but I'm gonna get back to y'all on that. Um, so let's move on to skincare a little bit. Um, another thing Kyra recommended was this Skin Fix Resurface AHA Renewing Cream. And um, it has 5% natural AHA and it has AHA, A-H-A is the name of it, but I say AHA, but 1% the um, lime extract. Um, so when you open it up, there is a very, very soft lime scent. It's like very, very subtle. So it's not intense at all. It's not like overpowering or offensive when you open it up, but you can smell it very, very subtly. So all the girls, even besides Kyra, a lot of people have been talking about skin fix in general and that it's really good for people with like um, dermatitis and eczema and I have eczema so again this is probably like day two or three of me getting ready to use it but um, so far I feel like I can tell like overnight how my skin drinks um moisturizer and how it likes it and so far this is pretty this is pretty nice but i will get back to you guys it says that it's for um dry rough bumpy and keratosis pilaris skin so we're gonna see we're gonna see this is free of uh, fragrances parabens formaldehyde which i don't know why they would have formaldehyde and anything anyway um and a bunch of other things oh it's been it's free from gluten okay so I'll get back to you guys on this resurface plus but I think it's gonna work also it is um it was voted best of beauty by Allure in 2019 so we gonna see it was an award winner um another thing I like in terms of creams is um Trader Joe's believe it or not they have <clears throat> their coconut a uh, body butter that they sell year round and then seasonally they drop like another um scent so in the fall they have this amazingly scented pumpkin body butter Ooh, i love that and then when i went back it was gone it was sold out so i got the grapefruit one for spring and baby you want to talk about thick oh my gosh this stuff is so Thick. how thick is she baby she's she's thicker than a snicker like i love this and it's also very brightly scented like um citrus i love anything citrus right now i'm using i'm trying to get rid of the stuff the products i have um so right now i'm using if y'all are familiar with the body shop and um their satsuma scent and it's like very very orangey like i mean you can smell it upstairs if you're downstairs if somebody puts it on so i'm trying to get rid of that but then after that i'm gonna um start using this and i'm gonna pair it with the skin fix because of course this will be like a daily use and this kind of will build on top just because i like the scent and i love the way it feels but it's very very thick if your skin is on the drier side you always want to look for um a product that is 
not runny, not watery, um, just high in cream and oil content and not in just water base because that's going to evaporate off the skin and then you're back dry again. So just to note, um, but I really like this. So I got two of these this time because I'm not about to be out here left naked Trader Joe's because y'all be just, y'all just play. Y'all just give us a limited amount. I mean, you might as well be fancy. But anyways, um, okay. So let's talk some more about skincare. Uh, Kyra has been talking about this for a while, but let me just step back a little bit. I have always been a proponent of silk pillowcases, and so I've been using them. You can purchase silk pillowcases uh, pretty much anywhere. You can order them online. Um, I've seen th things at like TJ Maxx and Marshalls and just anywhere so the market is huge for them however obviously some of them are probably going to be made of satin and not necessarily silk um so the price range can vary tremendously uh slip i did see on um kyra's page and she did mention and i agree that they're a little bit on the pricey side um however if you um like silk and you know what, what type of time we're on then you know why this is a great investment piece so i went ahead and got a couple um they are available on of course the slip i don't know if it's like slip.com or slip slip um, i don't see it on here but i don't know if it's like slip pillowcases.com or something like that but pull just type in like slip and pillowcase you'll find it they got that um nordstrom carries them in store as well as online and then amazon so i went ahead and got these off of amazon i got two it says here that these are pure silk pillowcases and if you know anything about silk silk has been a high demand fabric since um it was discovered or created during the um silk trade times and it is a very difficult material to um to manufacture and therefore it is and obviously it's in high demand and therefore it's expensive so um yeah it says here that they're recommended by um dermatologists plastic surgeons hairdressers and beauty experts obviously for different reasons but if you know anything about silk pillowcases or if you've ever tried to sleep on them versus regular so regular pillowcases absorb absorb oil they pull out can pull out your hair because of the little holes in the the way the fabric is manufactured like cotton um and then of course you know how you wake up and you have all the creases in your face that's because the material is so hard and harsh on the face so of course that's been associated with causing wrinkles and just damaging the skin over time and therefore baby like Anyways, I had to level up and, <laughs> and cop these because I've had pillowcases, silk pillow, silk or satin pillowcases from a bunch of places, but probably never um, these. And I'm assuming that these are like a hundred percent. If they say pure, baby, stop lying. You better be everything. But anyway, it says anti-aging, anti-sleep proofs, and anti-bedhead. I'm um, also so it's good. It's good for your hair. It's good for your skin um and then of course you should be washing your pillowcases anyway but you know it doesn't like soak in this oil and absorb it and then re you know it doesn't go back onto your face and cause you to have like acne and things like that so anyways i'm not i'm literally just not opening i was waiting to do this video but these are the slip pillowcases and then oh my gosh so you know how your so you know how iphone stalks you right so ever since i put in slip slip pillowcases um into what was it like instagram um because i was like okay i'm ready to buy it let me see where i'm gonna get them from when i did that all the of course they're like sponsored ads start coming up like every other day but also like all these other companies that i didn't know of that also sell so pillowcases popped up so there are other companies that have um you know varying prices and also a variation of colors so um yeah so i got two of the queen size white ones and i love the packaging because it's so like nice and clean and basic and it has this clear thing on it so i can't even get it out um i don't want to break my nails doing this because bt dub tracy per use snapped on these nails and y'all don't laugh at me i have to keep my nails short for work as a nurse but it's okay because soon that'll be done quit it's like no <laughs> just kidding um just kidding I can't get this out so I can show you, but I can see, like, you can see, like, how soft and luxurious it looks. Let me get some scissors. Hold on, y'all. As a matter of fact, oh, crap. I just got a package. Hold on. Okay. 
Period, y'all. Look. Okay, period, y'all. <laughs> I got another package. There's something I was going to show y'all which goes good with this, but I didn't think it was going to be here, but it just came. So I'm going to show y'all that. I'm excited, but let me try. I don't want, I can't find my scissors. So I'm about to try to. Because my nails broke. So they have it secured in here, okay? This is beautiful. This is giving so luxe. Oh, oh, it feels so good. Oh, this is. I don't want to take it out and touch it with my hands because my hands have a little bit of oil on them and makeup, but it's so soft, y'all. Baby. <laughs> Baby. Hey, oh. Baby. Oh, yo. <laughs> I'm in awe. This is so buttery. This is this is delish. For real. So, anyways, if you're feeling like splurging, go ahead and get you just get you one slip pillow. Like you don't have to have two. Get you one slip pillow and then you can get you one um from somewhere else that looks that look the same. You know what I'm saying? And then <laughs> You can sleep on the slip pillow and then just have the other pillow just sitting there. Just get you one. Um, see if they have a sale or you know, like whatever. But anyways, and then they have they have cute other pillows, like other colors too. They have, I know they have charcoal, they have silver, they have gray, they have this beautiful pink color. And like I said, there's other companies that have other colors too. So I might be, I might be cheating on slip a little bit. I don't know, cause. We gonna see, we gonna see, but oh, okay, let me show y'all. So I got two of those, let me show y'all what else I got. Oh, this is so exciting. I didn't know if this was gonna come. I got another thing from Slip. Which was the mask. I recently also, <clears throat> goodness. I recently also got the, oh cute, look at the little packaging for it. I'm a packaging sucker. And then it says slip on here. And it says reusable face covering. I just like to see the lies they, I just like to read the lies they tell. Oh, I'm so, oh wow, this comes with, <laughs> I'm so annoyed. This comes with like. <clears throat> the metal bars that you can put in so that you can shape it to fit your nose and whatnot and it comes with a bunch of them and it comes with the um rubber stoppers to hold it properly to your face so you can put them on adjust oh you can adjust them but okay that's cool that's really cool okay and then here's my mask so i got a silk mask from slip as well it's black and it's like, I said black, like it's black, like y'all don't know. It's black and beautiful like me. <laughs> Send help. Um, no, nah, but it says it's 100% silk outer and then 100% cotton inner. So, it looks like it has, yeah. So, it has a nose bridge already in there because I can, I've just molded and I can feel the metal piece. It has the little adjustable things and it's really tight. So, it's like squeezing on and off. I don't know. It feels good as fuck it's cute <laughs> okay i like this so this one wasn't necessarily what i would deem as expensive i feel like it i was i want to say it was like 15 dollars. so i feel like if you're getting any like fun or cute mask you're gonna spend that anyway so i wouldn't say that one was too expensive but so these are all the things i've gotten recently i need to really stop okay last but not least this first of all I need you guys to understand that I have a shopping problem and I talk about that in another video but that's irrelevant right now I have a problem with spending and I love items 
and that's my problem that's my addiction and i talked about this before but anyways that's my addiction so if you're not gonna sell help then stf you and get with get with me <laughs> it's like no i'm just playing but okay so i'm very much into feminine things and just things that make you feel like pretty and girly and like gorgeous like flowers so um you should buy yourself some flowers on a regular basis don't wait for nobody time waits for no man pure and so anyway so i've been buying things oh i forgot shit i gotta show you something else um i've been buying things that i feel like are just cute and feminine and gorgeous and of course like everybody's been per kind of purchasing these as well but i just think they're so darling i got those clear mugs let me pull one out for y'all baby uh, this, these are so cute and i've already used them um but i try to keep them you know well kept so that they don't crack because the glass is very thin these are from amazon from the company smeeze s-m-e-e-s-e -E -E, smeeze and i think it's a european brand but they are so freaking cute and when you put like co a lot of coffee or like matcha in here and you can see it it's just so pretty it's just so pretty it just it just gives me the feels i think this is so adorbs and then i want to show y'all something else but oh uh, i think it's up too high hold on let me see because i put the box away i can get it if i think tall box okay again these have nothing to do with skincare they're just things that are buying but this was a gift so i don't um i don't know where this is from but i got gold flatware what all right so my camera overheated sorry guys it just cut off and i didn't know why so i was like what that's the first time my camera's overheated but i got this gold flatware um it was a birthday gift that i was supposed to get it back in january it didn't come until like a couple weeks ago and we are now in april or we're in may just kidding so <sighs> Um, I'm not even going to link the company or anything or recommend them, but the flatware is gorgeous and I just think that this is just a nice um, way to serve when you're, you know, hosting people um, and I just, again, like things that make you feel pretty and feminine and just cute. So, I mean, if you're invited over, no, you know what, not if, come to the tea party at my house and get treated, okay? Get treated like a princess. <laughs> These are so cute. Anyways, well that is everything i am about to head out um run some errands and then come back and do spa day because it is self-care sunday so i hope you all have a lovely day and i'll see y'all later let me know what you think of the products okay bye